That shocking video of a United passenger being dragged out of the plane is raising awareness about the airline industry routine practice of overbooking flights. Now, listen to what happened to this woman who was bumped from her Delta Airlines flight and made a chunk of change. We ended up getting bumped twice and then finally canceling our flight and Delta compensated us with $11,000 and they refunded our tickets. That's right. Forbes magazine travel editor Laura Begley Bloom just wrote, why Delta Airlines paid me $11,000 not to fly to Florida this weekend. Laura, her husband and daughter volunteered to give up their seats on an overbooked flight, but she used her travel smarts to negotiate a jaw-dropping deal. You can negotiate a deal too if you're willing to be flexible about when you fly. Laura's flight was way overbooked. 60 passengers were on standby, desperate to get on the same flight as Laura's family. Delta asked for volunteers to give up their seats. Your rights as a passenger are if an airline has an overbooking situation, they must compensate you if they can't get you on another flight within a small period of time. Laura and her family actually agreed to be bumped from three different flights over the weekend. And each time they were given compensation. Total profit, almost $11,000. I say hold out for as much money as you can. This travel expert knew how to work the system. And here are some tips she recommends if you find yourself on an overbooked flight. Number one, ask ask if they're looking for volunteers on that flight. You might also want to tell the gate attendant that you want to hold out for a higher price. Number two, be nice. We witnessed people screaming at the crew, screaming at the staff, and it didn't really get them anywhere. What really got people somewhere was when they were nice. Number three, consider the form of compensation. It's much better to get cash or to get gift cards than it is to get travel vouchers. And finally, number four, don't check any luggage. That's the one mistake this savvy traveler made. I still haven't gotten my luggage back, so fingers crossed that I'll get it back.